Happening today, Duval County School Board members will take the next step in trying to hire a new superintendent. And the district is getting help in the process from the Florida School Boards Association. News for Jack's reporter Aaron Farrar live there at DCPS this morning. And Aaron, the last time the school district searched for a superintendent, it took a while, about seven months to find one. That was about five years ago when the school district hired retiring superintendent Dr. Diana Green. This time around, the school board is expecting and preparing for this process and this search to take about six months to find the new superintendent. This will not be a fast process. The district has to advertise the opening and will also seek input from the community on what is needed in the next leader of Duval County Schools. Once qualified applicants are identified, the school board will review their experience, their background, and hold interviews, and then make an offer, and that's after the school board agrees on a candidate. Keep in mind, when Dr. Green was hired five years ago, the process went on for a little more than seven months. That was from October of 2017 to May of 2018. Right now, six school districts in Florida, including Duval County, are either currently looking for a new superintendent or anticipate having a job opening at some point this year due to separations or retirements. 24 new superintendents have been appointed throughout the state since 2020. That school board workshop is expected to be here at the Duval County Public Schools headquarters starting at 1230 this afternoon. For the time being, Dr. Dana Krisnar is the acting superintendent and she anticipates and plans to be in that position for six months. Reporting live, I'm Aaron Farrar, Channel 4, The Local Station.